Have you ever wanted to give your alerts a little bit of extra pizzazz to make them just pop and stand out from other streams? Kind of like this? Well, today, you're going to find out how. What is going on, everybody? Welcome to the channel. My name is Mr. Boost. I stream on Twitch every Monday, Tuesday, and Thursday. And I'm here going to show you my scene twitching widget for Stream Elements and OBS. Uh, only going to need two things for this guy to get going. Uh, one is going to be the OBS WebSocket and then the widget itself. i uh, going to walk you through here on how to set everything up. The descriptions for everything are right below so that way you can get everything going. Uh, first things first, we're going to dive into the OBS WebSocket. Uh, lo located here on the GitHub, if you scroll down to the bottom, uh, you'll see the Windows installer exe file. Uh, once you download this, it's uh, executable, so you just open it up, it installs a breeze on it. Once it is installed, uh, what you're going to want to make sure you do is keep your OBS closed while the install is going on. Once it's done, you'll open up OBS. Uh, up here at the very tippy top, where it says tools, you want to click that guy. You got WebSocket server settings. I'm going to go ahead and click that. And then once you install it, this all is going to be blank. Uh, so what you'll want to do is make sure that the WebSocket server is enabled. Enable authentication. Throw in a password. Um, personally, you don't have to have enabled tray alerts enabled. Um, I like it disabled because I don't want it pinging all the time. Um, so I went ahead and disabled it. Um, once you're done with this, remember this password, just hit OK. Uh, once you've installed the Stream Elements widget, uh, first thing you're going to see whenever it comes up is it's going to just look like a blank page. Um, up here at the very tip top, you're going to see the layers. Go ahead and click that, and then you'll see Custom Widget 1. Uh, make sure that is selected, and then select Settings. Uh, this is where all of the goodies are going to be. Uh, you're going to have your global settings, your follow alert, your sub alert, tip alert, bit alert, host, and raid. Uh, first things first, we're going to go for the global settings. Uh, in here is where you're going to have your local host, your port, and your password that you entered in earlier. The only thing you're going to have to enter in is going to be your OBS password, and that's it. Uh, once you enter in your OBS password, the widget will automatically connect to your OBS. Uh, so that way you don't have to do anything. On the alerts, um, each one is going to have an enabled uh, field where you can turn that alert on and off. It's going to have the main scene, and the main scene is going to be um, if you're in a, a gaming scene that you always want it to be on, you'll select that scene, and then you have your switch scene. And basically what happens is that during your main scene, if you get an alert, it's going to switch over to your switch scene, and then right below it, you can see there's a time visible. Uh, that is going to be uh, the time between the two switches. So you have your main scene, an alert happens, it automatically switches to the switch scene over the allotted time that you've put in, uh, and then it's going to switch right back. Um, you can play around with these. If you don't want it to switch back, you can set the timer to zero. Um, same thing goes on all of the alerts here. So, you know, you've got your sub, your tip, your bit, your host. Um, I would definitely like to do some upgrading to this down the road uh, to allow, uh, say, for, for bits, for example, um, <clears throat> a certain amount of bits would trigger it rather than just be any bit. So, if somebody right now would donate a bit, it's going to fire this. Um, down the road, I would definitely love to add it in to set like a limit um, for it to be triggered. Um, but once you get these adjusted to where you want, we'll hop over here to OBS. Here in OBS, uh, you're of course going to have your regular scenes. And then what you're going to need to do is create a new scene. And within this scene, there we go. In game switch, just going to be completely blank in the sources. Uh, you're going to grab 
that link, add a new browser source, post that in there, and then close it. This scene is going to be completely blank. It's going to be the only thing in it, nothing else at all. Um, it just needs to be running at all times. Um, one thing that you will want to do that I usually recommend is shut down source when not visible. Um, that way, um, I ran into a few bugs before with it not checked, with it not switching. Um, and as we'll, we'll show you here. Let me move this guy off to the side. We'll do an emulate. Purdy, purdy. Once you have your scene, your switch scene set up, the only other thing you're going to need to set up is going to be the scene that it switches to. Um, and what I've done is I created just an a just a source car or a scene called alert scene. Uh, within this scene. Uh, you're going to paste your um, scene switch scene uh, browser source for it. And then your alerts. And then you can do pretty much anything else you want in here. You don't have to have your webcam with your alerts. You know, it's free range to do whatever you want, obviously. Um, and basically, what it's going to do is this is just going to read. Uh, wait for that web socket. It's going to see the web socket and then I'm actually switched back to the original scene um, It's pretty straightforward cut and dry um, If you have any kind of questions on it um, Feel free to leave a comment below um, <clears throat> I can try to read through there try to help out anybody who has any kind of bumps in the road with it um, You can also hit me up on twitch every Monday Tuesday Thursday nine o'clock Eastern time um, I'm streaming on there, so if you've got any questions at all with it, feel free to swing on in, and uh, I can try to help them out with you. Uh, until we meet again, it's your boy signing off. Deuces.